May 29th. On this day we celebrate the memory of the Holy Virgin and Martyr Theodosia. In the fifth year of Diocletian's great persecution, in 307, a young consecrated virgin, barely 18 years old, called Theodosia, in Caesarea in Pal Palestine, went up on Easter Sunday to the prisoners who had confessed the name of Christ and were waiting in chains to go before the judge and asked them to remember her when they attained the kingdom of heaven. Soldiers immediately seized the girl and took her before Urban, the governor. Suddenly filled with rage and fury, he ordered her to offer sacrifice to the idols. When she refused, she was cruelly tortured on her ribs, breasts and abdomen, the torture revealing her very bones. The saint, however, suffered in peace, and this supernatural state excited the fury of the magistrate even more. When he exhorted her once more to sacrifice, Theodosia, giving him a long, hard look, said with a smile, her face resplendent, Man, why have you gone so far astray? Do you not know that I am acting in conformity with my prayers, having been judged worthy to partake in the lot of Christ's martyrs? Seeing that the people were beginning to mock at him, Urban, unable to subdue her with the harshest tortures, ordered that she be thrown into the sea. Then he turned to the confessors, who had been encouraged by the girl's resistance and condemned them all to the implacable copper mines of Faino. Blessed is our God, always known for the birth of the ages of ages. Amen. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. O heavenly King, the comfort of the Spirit of Truth, who art in all places and fillest all things, treasury of good things and giver of life, come and dwell in us and cleanse us from every impurity and save our souls, O good one. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, be gracious unto our sins. Master, pardon our iniquities. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Traverse the depths of the Red Sea with dry shod feet. Israel of old vanquished the might of Amalek in the wilderness by Moses' arm stretched out in the form of the cross. 
O Holy Martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. God, who went willingly to the cross, became for thee the way unto contest, O Theodosia. For he cast down the tyrant, making him to be mocked by the martyrs like a sparrow. Holy Martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. Contending with endurance, thou didst mightily dash the author of error down to the earth, O all honour Theodosia. And thou hast received a crown of victory as a triumphant martyr. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. He that once was puffed up with arrogance is now laid low, cast down by thine endurance, O martyr. For taking up the power of the cross, thou didst shame him who vaunted without measure. Both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Treacherously beguiling me, the serpent took me captive by inspiring me with desire to become God. But through thee I have been called back again, O Immaculate Virgin, and have been truly and immutably deified. My church rejoices in thee, O Christ our God, as she cries out in joy. Thou art my soul's steadfastness, my strength and my refuge art thou, O Lord. O holy martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. Divine longing revealed thee to be a faithful bride of Christ, O Theodosia, and a martyr who loved his cross. Holy martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. Having forsaken care of the flesh which works corruption, thou leaves in the spirit who gives life, O honourable and all fame Theodosia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Heal my mind with the grace given thee of God, O God's martyr, and cure my soul which is enervated by passion. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Thou didst raise up my fallen form, O God's lady, when thou gavest birth to the author of the resurrection of our soul. Most wise Theodosia, martyr, truly blessed of God, by shining forth brightly in thy contest, thou, as is right, becamest the gift of God. Pouring forth the fiery beams of virginal splendor on the minds of all that ever bless and revere thee, and keep thy joyous feast day on earth, honoring thee with faith. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. By thy divine childbirth thou, O spotless maid, hast renewed the whole mortal nature of the earthborn, which was corrupt with passions and dead in sins. Thou hast raised all men from death to life, pure and endless. Wherefore, as is due, O thou most glorious Virgin, we all now call thee blessed as thou truly didst prophesy. When the church beheld thee lifted up upon the cross, O Son of Righteousness, it stood rooted in place, crying out as is meet, Glory to thy power, O Lord. O holy martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. The crafty tyrant was vehemently troubled and thought to terrify the temper of thine endurance with tortures. But thou, O Lord Theodosia, didst cry, Glory be to God. Holy martyr Theodosia, pray to God for thou us. Thou was enriched with the God given and divine name bestowed on thee in full knowledge, O prize winning martyr. For thou became God's gift, gladdening us who honour thee with faith and longing. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Apparelled in a stately garment, reddened with martyric blood, O godly mind Theodosia, thou didst cry, I run after thee with longing, O my bridegroom. Both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O pure virgin, in a God-befitting manner, thou gavest birth to the Word incarnate, and didst remain a virgin. Wherefore, with voices never silent, and faith and doubting, we cry, Rejoice to thee, O Lady. Thou, my Lord, art come a light into the world, a holy light, turning from dark ignorance those who hymn thee with faith. 
O Holy Martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. Out of love for Christ, the murder was poured out. Young maidens have followed after him with godly prudence, glorifying him in song. Holy Martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. Exchanging the temporal life for the eternal, the martyr inherited the kingdom of the heavens for but a very little blood. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The relics of the martyrs flow like fountains, with healings for the sick, and they heal the diseases of souls by faith. Both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Who is able to explain thy mystery, O all blameless one? For the Creator, whom nothing can contain, thou hast heard in thy womb. I will sacrifice unto thee with a voice of praise, O Lord. Thus cries the Church unto thee, for by the blood that flowed from thy side, because of thy compassion, she has been cleansed of demons' gore. O holy martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. Martyr Theodosia, imitating thy voluntary passion, eagerly chose death for thy sake, O Christ, not fearing the tyrant's threat. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Wounded with thy divine love, and longing for thee, and made strong by thy cross, Women have easily trampled upon the heads of the dragons, as thou didst say, O Saviour. Both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Finding thee to be a dove, altogether perfect and without spot, a bright lily seen afar off, and a flower of the valleys, O Mother of God, the noetic bridegroom made his dwelling in thee. Through labours hast thou inherited life free of pain. With streams of thy blood, O all-praised maiden, thou didst drown the vile lion who is the most abhorrent enemy of Christ's church. As thou now rejoicest with Christ, unceasingly pray thou in our souls' behalf. The children of Abraham in the Persian furnace, afire with love of piety more than with a flame, cried out, Blessed art thou in the temple of thy glory, O Lord. O holy martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. As he behold the adorned in faith that God bestowed beauty, O martyr Theodosia, we sincerely cry out in song unto thy bridegroom, Blessed are thou in the temple of thy glory, O Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Bearing thy lamp, O martyr, thou hast now entered the heavenly bridal chamber with the virgins, rejoicing in Christ, and crying out, Blessed art thou in the temple of thy glory, O Lord. Both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. He that sits upon a throne high and lifted up, found thee upon the earth as a throne fit for God, and he took up his rest thereon. Blessed art thou among women, O all blameless lady. When Daniel stretched out his hands in the den, he shut the gaping mouths of the lions. And the children, those lovers of piety, who were girt about with virtue, quenched the might of the fire as they cried, O all ye works of the Lord, bless ye the Lord. O holy martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. Loose from the bones of the flesh, O August Theodosia, thou flews up, rejoice into the nuptial chamber that is like unto light, dancing about the reed as a bride, and glittering with the red blood of martyrdom, and crying out, O oh, all you works, bless you the Lord. Holy Martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. Thou hast been deemed worthy to dwell in the heavenly ch- bright chamber in joy, O oh, August Theodosia, having found everlasting glory, and may truly reach with the fruit of thy courage. O oh, all celebrated martyr, as thou dost cry, O oh, all you works, bless you the Lord. We bless Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, the Lord. Thou hast proved to be rightly named indeed, O August Theodosia, for thou hast been given to us as an excellent gift from God, O all wise maiden, granting rivers of gifts that pass all understanding to those who sing with faith. O all you works of the Lord, bless you the Lord. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Having literally given birth to God, O all pure one, thou hast been shown to be literally the mother of God, bearing a divine name truly in accordance with thy giving of birth. 
Wherefore, with a godly mind, with a faithful, glorify thee as the Theotokos, O all blameless Lady. When Christ, the chief cornerstone, not cut by the hand of man, was cut from thee, the unhewn mountain, O Virgin, he joined together the separated natures. Wherefore, we magnify thee with rejoicing, O Theotokos. O holy martyr Theodosia, pray to God for us. As thou stand in the presence of the Almighty God, loose by thine entreaties the bones of the fancies of them that piously hymn thee, O all-famed and all-venerable martyr, godly-minded Theodosia. Holy martyr Theodosia, pray to God for thou us. Thou hast fittingly received that which our first mother Eve desired, deified in thine aspiration towards God, and become God by divine participation. Therefore we call thee blessed, O all-blessed Theodosia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Thy bridegroom is all sweetness, O prize winner. Christ is all spiritual gladness of heart, O Mother Theodosia. Since thou now hast enjoyment thereof, Remember us in thine intercession. Both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. The Word who set all things in order will to come in the flesh and dwell in thee, having found thee alone to be holier than all, and he showed thee to be the Theotokos in truth, O Virgin Mother. O Lord Jesus, unto thee thy Lamb doth cry with a great voice. O my bridegroom, thee I love, and seeking thee I now contest, and with thy baptism am crucified and buried. I suffer for thy sake that I may reign with thee, for thy sake I die, that I may live in thee. Accept me offered out of longing to thee as a spotless sacrifice. Lord, save our souls by her intercessions, since thou art great in mercy. Wisdom, most holy mother of God, save us. More honorable than the cherubim and beyond compare, more glorious than the seraphim, thee who without corruption gave his birth to God the Word, the very Theotokos, thee do we magnify. Glory to you, Christ God, O hope, glory to you. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Holy Father, bless. May Christ, O true God, in the prayers of his holy and all-pure Mother, with the prayers of St. John the Baptist, of the holy and all-praised Apostles, with the power and under the protection of the holy life-giving cross and all the holy bodiless powers of heaven, at the prayers of our fathers among the saints Ninian and Cuthbert, the bishops of God, Caesarus the Great of Egypt, Brandon the Navigator, Oran of Iona, Columba of Iona, Kenneth, Ronan, Moluog, Donan, Flannan, all the saints of all these islands, our protectors and our benefactors. At the prayers of the Holy Martyr Theodosia, the Virgin of Tyre, with the prayers of the Holy Righteous Martyr Theodosia of Constantinople, with the prayers of the Holy Hiram Martyr Albion, Bishop of the city of Anis and his disciples, with the prayers of the holy new martyr John of Thessalonica, who was perfected in martyrdom in Smyrna by the sword, with the prayers of our righteous father Alexander, Pope of Alexandria, with the prayers of the holy two martyrs, a man and his wife, their bones being broken with staves, have thus been perfected in martyrdom, with the prayers of our father among the saints, Maximinus the Confessor, Bishop of Treve in Gaul, who took in St. Athanasius the Great and St. Paul the Confessor in their exiles. With the prayers of the holy martyrs, Sicinius the deacon, Martyrius the reader, and Alexander, who being from Cappadocia and coming to Milan, was sent by St. Ambrose to preach the gospel and was slain by the pagans near Trent. With the prayers of the holy new martyr Andrew Argenti of Hios, who contested in Constantinople in 1464. With the prayers of the holy blessed John the Wonderworker, the fool for Christ's sake of Ustug, 
with the prayers of St. Burian of Cornwall, St. Dyfrig, and all those with them whose memory we keep this day. With the blessing and the protection of the holy icon of the most holy lady, the Theotokos, which is known as the surety of sinners, with the prayers of the holy ancestors of God, Joachim and Anna, and of all the saints, have mercy on us and save us. For he is good and he loves mankind. Amen. And the prayers of our holy fathers, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy upon us and save us. Amen.